So another really important idea is the idea that I'm always gonna have both of my arms inside or both of my arms outside. Okay, so for example here, I'm in a position where he can attack me from the close guard, so it's not the best position for me, but sometimes people are really eager to try and get themselves out. So they'll push on the knee here or they'll even like reach behind and because they let one arm stay over and they let one arm go under, okay, now I find myself in a triangle choke, okay? Whereas if I took both my arms out, okay, now I'm in a better position. I have a lot less vulnerability here. Or if I did decide to keep both of my arms in, okay? The same situation might happen from mount. Sometimes the person's on bottom here and they're kind of having trouble escaping. So instead of keeping both of their arms over the legs here, they're trying to bump, they're trying to move, escape and whatnot. And then they start putting one arm under and it's trying to move the person over. And then the person just starts moving into, again, like a mounted triangle or something like that, okay? And even though it's not like a really good escape, if they're gonna put one arm under, it's better that they just put both arms under because at least now I have much less vulnerability. If Jason tries to transition into something, it's really hard for him to choke me just because of that simple rule.